Hola mis amigos, welcome to the new segment Spanish with Ariel Gado. Today we are going to learn about the worst creature to ever live, la ardilla, the chipmunk. This word has come up in many recent phrases such as Las ardillas son traidores. Or my personal favorite phrase, one that I use in everyday conversation. Um, Vamos a matar a todos las ardillas. Now many of you are probably wondering, how do you say Alvin and the Chipmunks in Spanish? How should I know? You guys see how white I am. This has been a mildly racist moment with R.L. King. Hi everyone, and welcome to Cricken's Block. I'm your host, Cricken, and today we'll be creating a scale model of Washington, D.C. using a 1 to 500 scale. Now, of course, that means this thing is going to be huge. So, we're going to do these in one hour segments for about mm, 265 parts. First off is the Washington Monument. So, let's get out those trusty gray bricks at Educational, so for what? Hello, I'd like to order another pizza. Yes, another one. It's time for Mikey's Fun Time Show. Did you have a good time with us? Although we come to the last part of our show, there was still a couple more I have up my sleeve for you all. So enjoy, everyone. Live from the studios of Some Weird Guy's Basement, it's Mr. Handbox Man tonight. Now, here's Handy. Hello! I'm Mr. Handbox Man. How are you? Now, the other day I was walking down the street, even though I have no legs. I think that's the joke. <laughs> anyway, tonight we have a very special guest, all the way from the celestial body called the space. It's the moon! How you doing? Fine, fine! Now what have you been up to lately? Oh well, not much, just... You know... Rotating. Yes, I'd imagine it was very hard. Well, it is a constant push and pull, but, you know, that's my job. Right, right. Say, where are you right now, um, other than space? I think I'm somewhere over... London right now, yeah. China, maybe. I don't know. It all looks the same. Indeed it does. Say, I was informed that you were involved in a little bit of controversy recently. Uh, care to elaborate? I don't want to talk about that. Oh, come on. You're amongst friends. Well, <clears throat> back in 69, there I was just minding my own business. When uh, I looked down at uh, down at the earth, brilliant flash of light coming from there. Big old smoke cloud. 
sitting in a tiny dot, just coming on up. I thought they were just going to go past me, or maybe stay in the Earth's rotation, like me, because I'm the moon. But no. <laughs> they landed on me. They stepped all over me. <laughs> well, well, of course, they were running those Apollo <laughs> missions back then. I'm sure you understand. What? You insulting me? Making fun of me? No. Well, Mr. Handbox Man, three days. I'm sorry? You heard me. Three days before I come crashing into you. Well, I hope you enjoyed tonight's guest. Uh, the moon, everybody. Yay! Yeah, hey, anytime, you know. Well, I gotta wax out anyway, so. Later. I'm the moon. Yes, yes. Hopefully, much later. Uh, well, folks. Good night. Wow, folks. Well, if this didn't meet your expectations, then call what you like. And you know what? I'm not going to host the next episode. No. No. I need to put some of the CDs into the right hand. Someone who's a reviewer, who has a good heart, who has skinned this show before. Ah, screw it. I'm calling in a Canuck. Get it? Where does it say specifically on making animatronics? There's gotta be a page here somewhere. Hello, Anna. Oh, hey. Uh... What the fridge? Who the hell are you? I'm Miss Nightmare. I'm leaving you the host ideas to the next episode. Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. Hey, hey, wait a minute! I love you. Best friend, and he always will be. He'll never leave. He cares about me. He is the most wonderful person in the entire world. Everything he does is magic. Isn't that right, Charlie?